Hey, what's going on, you guys? Ozone 1414 here, and today I finally received my horror block. This is actually for December 2016. Today is January 5th, I believe. I don't know what the problem is, but these things arrive later and later every month. And uh, I know some people are going to be like, well, it's the holidays, you know, the mail's backed up. And uh, that's understandable, but that doesn't explain why it's late the 11 other months out of the year. But uh, anyways, I finally got it today. Going to get it open and see what we got. This is the last one for 2016. Okay. And as always, you guys can take a quick look inside. Take the shirt out. Put it off to the side. I'd say those to the very end. First thing I see is American Horror Story. Okay, I take a quick look at it. Box, I'll take it out of here. Okay. Okay, and this is, it looks like a coffee cup type thing. It doesn't have a handle on it. I don't watch American Horror Story, but I mean, this looks kind of cool, I guess. I don't know if I'll be keeping it, but whatever. Put that back. All right. Next thing I see, there's a black box with some devil satanic stuff on the front of it. Doesn't exactly say what it is, so let's get it out of here. Okay, it's got the same image on the item. It looks like a candle. That's a, one of those battery operated candles. Okay, first take a look at it. A little satanic symbol both sides. Turn it on. Okay, I don't know how good it's going to pick up on my camera, but there you go. A little flickering battery operated candle. That's kind of cool. I like that. Next thing I see is a Nightmare on Elm Street Freddy Krueger Flask Nerd Block Exclusive. Take a look at the packaging. I will get it out of here. You guys can check it out. Let's see what we got. Alright, it's a sweater with some claw marks on it. I think the design is really cool. I just, I mean, what am I going to use a flask for? I mean, it looks cool. Uh, I just don't know what I'm going to use it for. Alright, there's that. Next up is a Army of Darkness. Looks, I guess it's a mouse pad. That's really nice. I could use a new mouse pad, so I'm sure I'll be using this. Next thing I see is the Rue Morgue magazine. Now, I do know in 2017, Rue Morgue is only going to be doing this every other month, publishing their magazine, so I wonder what Horrorblock's going to do on those months when there's not a Rue Morgue. I wonder if they're going to throw something extra in. I don't know. But I do enjoy reading these. There's that. Now, let's take a look at the cards, and then we'll get to the shirt. Alright, let's go with the spoiler card first. Got the uh, Nightmare on Elm Street flask. Got the American Horror Story. Oh, it's not a coffee cup. It's a pencil holder. Okay, that makes sense why there's no handle on it. The uh, LED candle, the Army of Darkness mouse pad, the Rue Morgue. And let's see, next month, Resident Evil. And the Silence of the Lambs. Oh, boy. That's going to be an awesome box. Not really. And, of course, here's the... $10 credit for Nerd Block Shop. Got that. Alright, let's take a look at the shirt. You can already tell what it was when I opened it. And it is a Ouija shirt. This is pretty cool. I like this. Alright, very nice. What's the tag say? The tag even says Ouija and it says exclusive design on the bottom. Alright, so there you go. There is Horror Block. Finally, for December 2016, pretty happy with it. Um, probably my favorite item would probably be the shirt. My least favorite would be the pencil holder, which I thought was a coffee cup, but whatever. Uh, that's it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.